What's up, everybody? My name is Vince. Welcome to the channel. If it's your first time here, you might not know that on the weekends, Saturday night, Sunday, more lovingly referred to as Saturday Night Live and Sunday Fun Day, we do big box store tool tours. Say what? Yes, you heard it right. Big box store tool tours, like the Home Depot and Lowe's. And recently, we spied ourselves what looked to be some really good deals on the wall flexible kits. We're gonna tell you a little bit about those kits and something you might wanna look out for, and it's coming right up. Yeah, uh -huh. you know what it is. I purchased this the wall 996 in a combination kit with an impact driver the 887 I lovingly refer to this kit as the flex volt starter kit why because it came with this flex volt 6 amp hour battery it came with a 2.0 20 volt max battery but it came with this fast charger from the wall if you wanted to see how amazingly fast and how cool it charges these flex volt and 20 volt max batteries. Go on over to this playlist here. Go check that video out. Pretty amazing stuff. But the reason for today's video is because over the previous weekend when we did a big box store tool tour, we spied a what I would have called a flex volt starter kit. It was the flex volt circular saw. It was the 887 impact driver. It came with the Flexvolt 6 amp hour battery and I believe a, an amp and a half 20 volt max battery. The difference between that kit and the kit here is, is that instead of coming with this fast charger, it came with something that resembled this DCB 107, which is a standard 20 volt max charger. It's not a fast charger. And I, I, at first I was kind of puzzled. I said, whoa, can this standard charger even charge that 60 volt max battery? How long would it take? So today we have, boom, a fully discharged 60 volt max. We got our charger, we got our battery, it's in place. We're gonna flip our switch on our beautifully mounted power strip. Boom, we're gonna start the timer. And then periodically we'll check the temperatures as well because this fast charger charged these batteries, the 60 volt and 20 volt max, unbelievably cool. Will this non-fan equipped charger cause the batteries to really heat up? Let's find out. Boom, boom. We got the flashing red light. This is gonna be a while. See it in a bit. Well, let's get a temperature at the nine minute mark. Battery and charger. Coming in at 82 degrees, and the charger itself a little hotter, about 84, 84 and a half degrees. Okay, let's get a temperature at the 50 and a half minute mark. Battery itself, the bottom of it at least is at 82.2 degrees, 44 degrees. The charger is. 95 I got, 95 degrees, the side wall of the battery is about 85 degrees, a little warmer than the bottom. Let's get another temperature at the hour and 10 minute mark. The bottom of the battery is at 82, 83 degrees, the charger itself, oh, broke 100 degrees. The charger itself is over 100 degrees. Temperature at 4 hours. Battery is 86. Charger is 102. 103, 104. Dang. Still charged. Well, there you have it. You can expect that if you're going to be using the DCB-107 style charger, non-fast charger, 
you can expect that you're going to have extremely, extremely long charge times when you're charging a higher amp hour battery. Now, there's a couple points I like to make. If you're already in the FlexVolt system and you already have a fast charger, maybe that FlexVolt kit, maybe it doesn't matter that it's coming with this charger. And if you can save a couple dollars, it's fine for you. But on the flip side, if you're not in the FlexVolt kit just yet, you might want to take a look at the boxes, take a look at exactly what you're getting because I think it would be a real benefit if your first kit included one of these fast chargers. It comes down to make sure when you think you're getting a sale, are you getting apples to apples? Is the price lower because it truly is a sale? Or are you getting lesser components in that sale item? Just some food for thought. And if you like videos that give you some food for thought and allow you to think critically and make better purchasing decisions, then smash the like button. Also, you're going to want to get subscribed and allow all notifications by cracking that bell icon and let all notifications through from the very cool guys. Why do you want to allow all notifications? Because we publish videos daily. We also do emergency tool deal videos. Some of those tool deals may only last a matter of minutes. Never miss another tool deal ever again! With that, I want to say I appreciate every single one of you being here. Leave your comments down below. Would you prefer if some of these kits didn't even come with a charger? Do you like it better when they come with a fast charger? Maybe you don't mind the standard charger. Let us know in the comment section. Let's get the conversation started and we'll see you on the next one. Video's over, but I know you want more. So this is how you're going to get it. First thing you need to do is pretend you're this guy and you're here at the birthplace of freedom. Now ring that bell like it's 1776 and let all notifications through. What? You're not subscribed yet? Well, smash this button here. After that, watch this video here, here, and maybe over here. See you later.